from the shores of Lake Victoria, this is Dr. Vitalis Ugola. In partnership with Ponea Health, I work at Royal Dental Clinic in Kisumu, Homo Bay in Migori. A topic that has bothered many, many Kenyans is teeth discoloration, commonly referred to as brown teeth in our country, and that is what today I will share with you about. Some things that you take for granted is that what really make your teeth white? Primarily, teeth are made of what we call blocks. To go into the details is something called fluoroxyapatite, blocks that form your teeth. Your tooth is not just a ball, it is formed of some small blocks. It is primarily white, uh, the color, but if there's a distortion on the balance of how the teeth are made, then you end up with different colors of the teeth. What are the predisposing factors that contribute to teeth discoloration? Many things would make your teeth become discolored. The most common in our society is a high fluoride content. Fluoride is part and parcel of the tooth tissue, but when it is in excess during teeth development, it makes your teeth become brownish in color. Things which are less commonly known is that there are certain drugs that when people take during pregnancy, they end up having discolored teeth. An example is tetracycline that can easily make teeth become green in color. There are certain types of food that when people eat more often, they predispose your teeth to discoloration, like certain spices over time when you use them more often, make your teeth become discolored. When your teeth are worn off, they end up exposing the inner layers of the teeth, which are a bit more brownish or yellowish than the outer layers, which could also make your teeth get discolored. But in our society of Kenya, the most common cause of discoloration is a high fluoride level, which is commonly found in water, in tea, and all that, which is higher in certain regions more than other areas. So those are part of the things that lead to discolored teeth. What are the options of somebody who has discolored teeth, and do those procedures weaken your teeth? There are many things that people can do to whiten their teeth, but they depend on the severity of the brownness or discoloration. If your teeth are so discolored, then you will need to seek the services of a dentist. If they're very mildly discolored, then a few things can be done, like the toothpastes that whiten teeth. One of them is Colgate Optic White or many other brands of toothpaste that are available in the market. Some, of course, don't, are not as effective, but most of them are things that require dentists to intervene. When you present to a dentist with brown teeth, there's what we call microabrasion, where we mix some powders just to brush off the outer surfaces of the teeth. That is for very mild uh, discoloration, and it can remove off the brown spots or the discolored spots. Masking is one of the options that you could have. Uh, of course, it is not as very long term, but it's one of the options. If your teeth are worn off, then we could remove, we could drill off the brown parts and put up a filling material that looks more brighter. The other option is now what we call whitening procedures in the dental clinics. There are many methods. There are those that we give you a tray, you go away at home with some gels to apply as you sleep at night or during the day, which will whiten your teeth. There are in-office whitening methods, part of which we do in our clinic, that you come and it would improve the color of your brown teeth. We have had many patients come and we whiten their teeth. In some cases, we put what is called a crown or veneers on the teeth. You can picture how ladies put some things on their nails, like artificial nails. We make something similar, but professionally done and, and fit for human use, that is put on the teeth that would cover the brown part. So those are some of the, the methods. Do they weaken your teeth? Yes, some of them weaken your teeth because we, take, we remove off some layers of your teeth, but we cover them. If you go to a dentist, any layer of your tooth that is removed would have a cover on top. Some whitening methods that are seen uh, that just try to grind off the brown teeth without replacing the layer if it is too deep would put your tooth at risk of breaking off. But if you go to a professional dentist, of course like our facilities, then you would definitely have a cover that would not weaken your teeth. Thank you for taking your time to listen in to the information that we've shared. We are grateful and hope that you've learned something from us. Should you seek to get our services, we are at Royal Dental Clinic in Kisumu, Homabe and Migori. Feel free to reach through us, to reach to us through ponea.com, which is a platform that enables you get to us. And beyond this, there are many topics that will come your way in dentistry and others. 
through Ponea in other episodes. Mm -hmm.